Hello everyone, in this chapter we will learn how to stop, start Oracle uh, to LC database instance and uh, also we will uh, learn some useful tips to do basic administration of Oracle to LC database. First we will open the server, uh, our database server uh, using the PuTTY. Uh, PuTTY is a secure client, a secure shell client, SSH client. So we can access database server through the PuTTY. And in this chapter as I mentioned uh, we will learn how to stop, start uh, the plug databases and uh, container database. So let's see first see uh, where which database we are connected. So these t actually uh, we have one plug database and one container database. So we'll go step by step hands on. I already uh, put all queries in one text file. So uh, at the end of this lecture I will upload this file for your reference. So now we can check see the status of plug database is the read write. So it is accessible for the user uh, or for the application. So I open this text file and you can see you can check this status from the instance uh, dynamic views. mentioned we have two databases one root container one pluggable databases and we will have many pluggable databases under one root container so as we know Oracle 12 C is a multi tenant database architecture so let's see this one so from root container we can switch to our pluggable databases. So pluggable databases called PDBs and container database called CBDs, CDBs. So uh, we just uh, do some test and we stop the instance of the PDB test in pluggable database. So we will see first we need to switch to plug database because currently we are connecting uh, connected to the root container databases CBT database so we already uh, alter so it is very simple uh, we have one container root container from root container we can switch the plug databases we can do all basic administration on plug database. This is a beauty of multi architecture database system Oracle 12 C. So this query we can connect to the CDB database and we can run this query and we can see how many kind of databases we have in this database server. So same we can connect to the pluggable database mean we can switch from CBD to pluggable databases and we can see uh, how many pluggable databases we have in under a uh, root container so these all queries is the basic uh, administration actually uh, this all lecture is uh, only for beginners not for expert level so in this lecture uh, as per our agenda we need to know how to see the uh, current uh, status of the database and how to stop the database and how to start the database and how to switch uh, to the pluggable database from root container from pluggable database how to switch back to the root container so can use show parameter and we can see but currently uh, this uh, we are connecting to the sys dba user we can see the parameter now we are currently connecting to the container database which is called db test so 
so if you see show container con underscore name so it is pdb test so we'll have one global instance db test under db test we uh, this global instance have a root container under root container we have one pluggable database db test so let's stop uh, db test altered so now we can check the status of db test before it was read write open for the users it is accessible for the users now it is on mounted stage in mounted stage as we know in database oracle database we have different stages we have no mount we have mount and we have open stage so each stage has own description so we will not talk, talk about uh, this uh, description so we can again we open the database so these are basic command uh, to check the current database status either a root container database or PDBs pluggable databases You can also uh, check the services, DNS names, services under uh, uh, this uh, database uh, server using above query. We can also see the, we can also grab the database instance which is called DB test. This is DB test, I am telling again and again, we have one DB test global database system.